Hey guys, welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to be going through the process of making a recent wolf commission, so stay tuned. First off, I'm going in with my black chromacryl paint that I use for around the eyes and the nose. And again, I'm putting down that one layer of black paint and then going over it again once the fur's been applied. I really enjoy making wolves, they're probably my favourite out of every doll that I make. And here's the first layer down. Now onto painting the iris of the eyes. I'm going to be using this really nice blue paint by Lumiere Jacquard in pearlescent blue. And like I've said before, this paint has really good coverage, so I only need to put down one layer. And you can see how sparkly and really nice this paint is. See how great the coverage is? Love it. I'm just going in and painting the pupils here, so sorry for the awkward angle. going in and putting down two little white dots on their eyes and I just feel that it gives a bit more depth. Alright moving on to painting the paw pads. So I'm just using that same black chroma grill acrylic paint. Once the pieces have been painted up and dried, I then make a wire armature and I usually choose not to show how I make the armature because I want to encourage people to experiment and come up with their own sort of technique and it makes it unique to your doll. Once these have been painted and I've made the armature, um, I usually cut out pieces from faux fur and sew it up on a sewing machine and I don't usually show that because everyone knows what it looks like to sew on a sewing machine so I usually skip that. Alright, once everything's sewn up on the sewing machine, I then hand sew the legs together using a ladder stitch. If you want me to show you a little tutorial on how to make a ladder stitch, let me know in the comments down below.
attaching the fur piece to the resin using a tacky fabric glue, which you can get from any local craft store. It's pretty cheap, so. that's it from me today guys i hope you enjoyed if you have any specific request that you want me to make do leave it in the comments down below and don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one bye